I'm local forecaster Brandon Rue on this Groundhog Day, a rough one. Winter storm warning started Wednesday morning, goes all the way through Wednesday, Thursday, and expires at 10 p.m. Thursday, maybe a little sooner than that. Here's the way it looks. Our rain switching over to snow here between 8 and 9 a.m., all snow. And then from 11 a.m. until about 4 or 5 p.m., that will be some of the heaviest, most consistent snow of a half an inch to an inch per hour. And we could have a half a foot on the ground by 4 or 5 p.m. Looking at snow totals, though, fewer Inches across our north zone, maybe six to eight inches north of I-69. And then we're looking at, you know, seven to nine inches through I-69 and M-59 with nine to 11 inches closer to downtown. And probably the healthiest amounts will be closer to a foot down close to the Ohio border. Again, from two days of snow, uh, and a lull in the action, which is why these numbers are down a little bit. Overnight, we're going to get some dry air, at least temporarily. So seven inches to eight inches north, all the way to a foot in our south zone still seems to be about right for this two-day snow event. And here's a look at the model that shows, again, some pretty healthy snow taking over by midnight, 1 a.m., a dry slot. We dry things out a little bit, but we do have more snow moving in through the morning and afternoon on Thursday with a couple of inches more. Again, when all said and done, probably most of us below a foot of snow from both days, but uh, additional two, three inches tomorrow with snow and blowing snow Thursday. Much colder and wind chilly, dangerous cold Thursday, Friday, Saturday.